Today we are going to perform a conductometric titration of HCl versus NaOH. Both HCl and NaOH are strong electrolyte, hence we will see a big change in the conductance while titration. The pipette solution is HCl and the burette solution is 0.5 normal NaOH solution. While titration, there should not be a large change in the volume, hence burette solution should be in high concentration. Every time 0.5 ml NaOH is added in HCl solution. The electrodes are dipped in the solution to measure the difference in ionic concentration. More the number of ions, more is the conductance. This is the principle of conductometric titration. Initially, when we add NaOH to HCl, a neutralization reaction starts. HCl get consumed to form NaCl and water. As the H plus ion concentration get decreased, the conductance also goes on decreasing. Later, we see there is increase in the conductance after the consumption of HCl. This is because extra addition of a NaOH that give rise to the conductance. So, what we are going to do is to find the conductance that we call initial conductance at 0 ml of NaOH. Here it is 32.1. When we note it down, then we continue the addition of 0.5 ml. After the addition of 0.5 ml, we see there is a change in the conductance. It is now decreased to 31.0. We continue further addition. We see there is still the decrease. Twenty-eight point two. Twenty-six point six. Okay, thank you. 25.5 24.2 29, 22.9, 21.5, 20.3, 19.1, 8 16.6 15.4 14.3 13.2 8.2 This time there is increase in conductance
13.0 13 13.6 14.2 After the neutralization point there is a decrease in the conductance but after the neutralization there is increase in the conductance again the decrease in the conductance is larger than the increase in conductance. This is because of a loss of H plus sign. H plus sign being smaller in size carries conductance in large extent than the Na plus and OH minus sign. After the titration, we will plot the graph and the graph will tell us exactly the neutralization point as a equivalence point. Using this, we can find the concentration of a unknown HCl solution by using known concentration of NaOH solution. A simple formula used for this, this we call N1 V1 is equal to N2 V2.